Hey, what's up? It's Valar. Thank you so much for checking out the video. I know I have actually been gone from making content for about a month. Um, and I just got bored of Raid for a little bit, actually. But now I do have a little bit of a passion back. My family and I just spent a week at the beach. And actually, the funny thing is, I had such a good time there. But I also realized I want to get back in the game and actually start making more content and doing streaming and everything again, too. So I will be playing Raid regularly again. I just really feel good about that break. And the funny thing is I pulled shards as I got them and I sort of just lazily did my dailies and stuff. And that was about it really. Um, for a few weeks there, all I really did was dailies and maybe pick clan boss if I didn't forget. Uh, but it was actually good to take that break. But in that break, <laughs> I pulled three non-dupe legendaries and I pulled every shard I got without like, saving it or anything i got venus with from one single void shard from the clan boss i had no shards besides one single void shard which is pretty hilarious that i got her <laughs> and then i had three ancient shards from who knows what and i pulled mashaled <laughs> on the third one i was literally just doing the three ancient shards there i'm like i'll just pull these three ancient shards for the daily quest and boom i get mashaled on one of them um and then today i got a sacred from clan boss and i get robar now there is a 10x going on and i did actually get the monthly pack um and then spend some gems a little bit of gems on getting a couple extra shards so i'm gonna open all these shards because i would actually like to get um i already have lugan but i really want all tan or ignatius when the, when robar came out i'm actually happy i got robar because i do like robar uh but I really want Altan, I really want Ignatius, and I wouldn't mind getting Solus, and I really do need Sepulchre or Sentinel. Not Neater, but Water. So, it's not many shards I have. I'm going to open all these, just because I feel like it. So, that's pretty much it. I will be doing regular YouTube content again, most likely daily, at least four times a week. And I'm going to stream at least two times a week. I do want to know, if you want to comment down below as well, do me a favor. Let me know if you're still watching it because I figure I've been gone so long. The only people going to watch this is probably like my diehard fans. Not diehard, but people who have been with me since the beginning or watch everything I put out. So let me know if you want me to stream on Twitch or YouTube because I don't even know if I'm still a Twitch affiliate. I might be. But I've considered that I should just stream directly on YouTube. And I know that most people stream on Twitch, but that's actually one of the reasons I think maybe YouTube needs a streamer as well for raid. So... That's kind of what I was thinking is maybe I'll just stream on uh, on YouTube. The other thing too that's been cool is I've been getting my health better in order. I've worked out all the time now. So I, I think – and I've been going back – I'm back at work in the office five days a week now. So there was a lot of busyness and we had a vacation plan and stuff too. So I kind of just said I'm just going to take a break. I decided – I almost decided to quit the game actually too. So just to be fair – I want everybody to know that I was contemplating quitting the game, but I decided I played a lot of other games. I played Dragon Champions, which I'm still going to make some content on, Marvel Strike Force, which I'll make one-off stuff on every now and then, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes, and then just a bunch of PC games. And the thing is, I still like Raid. I'm still going to play, uh, and I'm going to have a new player series coming out soon as well, too. So anyway, with all that being said, let me get into the shards. Uh, I'm completely sober, so apologize. I didn't have any vodka or anything like that. I just got back from seven days at the beach and had some vodka there, but I'm just chilling tonight. So anyway, here we go. Let's just whip these shards and make this just a few minute video. I don't want to. I don't want to drag this out. And come on, like the, let me just get Sepulchre Sentinel. Actually, I'd be kind of happy with that. Uh, no, not her allure. <laughs> Another allure. I pull allure left and right. Allure is really good for uh, reducing the turn meter on the Fire Knight. Because it has it on A1, which is really cool. So um, she is a great champion. And 20, I mean, what am I expecting with 20 ancient shards? Pretty much nothing. You know? <laughs> so 20 ancient, 20 ancient shards and a bunch of food. That is exactly what it's going to be. Okay. Four void shards. The hilarious thing is in these 10x, I pull legendaries in these 10x. And it's almost never the actual legendary that is targeted during the 10x. I pulled Hegemon when I was trying to get Venus. I got Venus just off of a one-shot when I was basically considering quitting the game. So <laughs> I literally have put a post in, in my to some of the clan officers saying I'm considering quitting. 
And then I open Venus, <laughs> which is hilarious. All right, let's see. Come on now. Come on. We've only got some sacred, so this will, only, this will be real short. You know, like and subscribe, all that jazz. Uh, Gallon Long Braids. I think this is my third Gallon Long Braids. But I would. Gal is really good, and I have a guide on her, so go check out that if you haven't already. Um, now let's get these three sacreds out of the way here. Come on, Sepulchre. Some of that, not all the ultimate Gaelic. Uh, <laughs> uh, ultimate Garlic. Sepulchre. Oh, Stagnite's good. You know, when I have two Stagnites, I don't know if it's worth building two Stagnites or anything. I should have just stopped at Robar, really. Oh, oh, come on, come on, come on. Yes! <laughs> this is hilarious. <laughs> I'm sucked back in now. Now you... <laughs> oh, I didn't get Altan, but really, that's something I don't actually need Altan because I do have an unkillable comp. I have two man ears, all that stuff. So I don't even need a decrease attack. Uh, but I would have liked all the time. But this guy, I really do want. Yes! So Nightmare Campaign Farming. Great Arena. Oh, man. I'm actually pumped getting him. The stun on his A1, that's not the great thing. But his AoE, that 50% chance of placing Provoke. And then he also has an AoE, that 75% chance to do HP burn. And it cannot be resisted. Um, and also, ally defense in all battles by 25%. You can look at his ratings here, but this guy's just a beast all over the place, pretty much. Yeah, I guess, except for Fire Knight. That makes sense. And Clan Boss, I wouldn't really use him in there either. But anyway, that's going to be it. <laughs> we pulled Ignatius on the very last shard. So I'm going to be back making regular raid content. You guys are actually the part that's kept me in this community, too, and everything. And I really don't want to give that up because I feel actually that a lot of people, you know, I'm still going to, I still like raid is the other thing, too. And I actually taking that month off was really, really good to get, kind of renew my interest in playing again. So with that being said, thank you very much. I'll be back soon with another video. Cheers.